morning students today is day 9 the chapter is sets the first concept is the first concept is power set what is power set a set containing all the possible subsets of a particular set is called power set it is it is noted by pa so <coughs> for example if a equals 1 to 3 what are the possible what is the power set of a possible subsets of a so first of all five then single one then single two then single three then now we take single single elements now we shift to double elements one two one three two three one two three remember one thing One comma two, two comma one. What is the same thing? The order does not uh, make any sense in this in the sets. So a equals to one two three. The subsets are five. Single elements one two three. Double elements one two one three two three. The third one third uh, the three elements one two three. So the total are one two three four five six seven eight. So the answer is. Eight subsets. Another example. If A equals to A B, now the power set is five. Single elements A, single elements B, then A B. So the number of elements are subsets are four. The next concept is concept of This is a sign of belongs to. So now the elements of A are one, two, three, four, five, six. Now two dash A. Now two is an element. It means two belongs to A. This is true. Five belongs to A. Five is an element which is present in A, so this is also true. But if now this becomes sets belongs does not connect with the set, or we can say whenever there is a sign of belongs to, we never use curly braces. So this is false because. Belongs to means element. The element is only six. There is no need of curly braces. The next example, three. This is also true. So if seven. Now this does not belongs to A. This is a sign of does not belongs to A. Seven does not belongs to. A. So I repeat, two belongs to A. The element, this element, is present in A. The five is present in A. This is a set. This becomes set. So whenever there is a sign of belongs to, we don't need these curly braces. We need only element, not set. So again, three is a subset uh, belongs to A. Seven does not belongs to A because seven is not present in. The set A. So this is another another example related to the concept of belongs to and subset. A जरा question आपको पिन आपके बीच करते हैं. A की value है one comma two curly braces three comma four comma five. Now three comma four curly braces three comma four is a subset of five. जेरे भी आप बड़े curly braces के बीच चीज़ आने ये सारे elements हैं. तो जो बड़ा करली बेसिस है ये रिप्रेजेंट करता है सेट नो नाउ 3 कॉमा 4 इधर दे बीच है सो ये एलिमेंट है जे एलिमेंट है एलिमेंट दे नाल हमेशा की आंदा बिलोंग्स टू बट उने की आ रहा है सबसेट याद रखना है रिमेंबर वन थिंग जे सबसेट है करली बेसिस से बड्डियां जरूर आउंगी है जे बिलोंग्स टू है ता करली बेसिस दे व्हिच जो चीज है वो आएगी सो ये बीच है आ देखो ये बिल्कुल ये बिच है सो एक ये बिलोंग्स टू ए सबसेट की दिस इज फॉल्स नाउ दिस इज ट्रू 
because this is the element which is present in in the curly braces so eh ek element hai is ka kya naam kiya hai belongs to it now aa ki hai element hai but element de naal vaddiyan curly braces vi aaiyan ne so ek ban jayega ek subset subset de naal hamesha a vaddiyan curly braces aan ke aan ki hai te element de vich jehde curly braces de vich element ne sirf ohi aan ke for example one now one belongs to a the sign is belongs to one simple this is true now one is a subset of a false whenever there is a sign of subset jo bhi sign subset hai tab curly braces aani aani hai so this is false but if the question becomes this this is true kyon एलीमेंट के नाल हमेशा जदों कर्ली ब्रेसेस आ जाते हैं वो सेट बन सेट बन जाते हैं तो वो सबसेट ऑफ ए बनता है द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन 1 2 5 1 2 5 विद द कर्ली ब्रेसेस सो दिस बिकम्स सेट व्हिच इज अ सबसेट ऑफ ए ट्रू अगेन 1 2 5 विद द कर्ली ब्रेसेस नाउ अगेन विद द कर्ली ब्रेसेस so curly braces this becomes subset not belongs to but this is false but the question becomes 1 2 5 belongs to a then it is true so now the next question is 1 to 5 again this is a repeated question 5 5 does not belongs to any set any set this is false but as we studied earlier phi is a subset of every set either it is set a b c so phi is a subset of every set this is true again curly braces phi we don't use curly braces when there is a symbol phi so this is false because the phi is a empty set but This denotes that there is an element. So this is uh, uh, this contradicts the statement. So this is a false. <coughs> so I can repeat it again. The word is simple concept. Hai, belongs to the subset. Belongs to the meaning of curly braces. It which element is O on it? Subset the meaning of which uh, curly braces which element is O? The noun curly braces on it. So curly braces which are on it, O subset. Hai. so simple so <clears throat> this is the concept of belongs to an subset